today I'm going to be taking you along as we take Pinky with us to go do Easter pictures with my little nephew Justice. It's going to be similar to our Judy Bunny Meet Santa Claus vlog where we took Judy Bunny to meet Santa Claus and get pictures taken with my son Logan. So today we're going to be doing a similar thing. Now as I do not advocate for studios owning bunnies just for the simple fact of having props for other children to take Easter photos with, I do feel that it's okay that if you own a bunny and your bunny tolerates it, that it is okay for you to do Easter pictures with your pet or your friends and family members to incorporate them in their Easter pictures. Um, so that's what we're going to be doing today. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and we will see you in a few minutes. So all we're doing right now is getting our carrier readier for our carrier. I know it does say dog on it, but we really like this carrier. We have that hard case one too that we used in the Judy Meet Santa vlog. Um, but this one's just so much easier to access the bunny out of and I really like it a lot better. Um, so we'll be using this one even though it was our old dog carrier. So in it, we're just gonna be putting a fleece blanket and then we're gonna be adding some hay to it. And then when it's time to go, we're going to be putting a uh, pinky in it. So we'll see you in a few minutes once we get her all settled in and ready to go. Pinky's all ready to go and we're just going to be getting ready to get in the car and go off to do our Easter pictures with my little nephew Justice and our bunny Pinky. We find out at this point that Pinky will not be allowed in the photo shoot, despite the website saying that pets are allowed. Due to JCPenney's policy, you have to be the last photo shoot of the day if you're incorporating your pet. So instead, here's some cute footage of Justice getting his photos done and Pinky doing some shopping with us. Don't forget to stick around till the end of the video to find out how you can enter our 100 subscriber giveaway. hanging out at the portrait studio now. We're just waiting to view the pictures and see how they turned out. So, Pinky's just exploring and enjoying her time right now. <laughs> You're doing a good job, bud. Doing a good job. Yeah, yeah. today. Today is finally our 100 subscriber giveaway video. So all you have to do to enter the giveaway is make sure you're subscribed to our channel down below. Just press that subscribe button, give this video a like, and comment down below with your bunny's name. Okay, if you don't have a bunny, that's okay. You can still enter. Just comment with our bunny's name, Lion, L-Y-O-N. Our giveaway is pictured right here. It is a bag of hay. Um, it is our farm fresh hay that we get from a farm nearby in the Tampa Bay area. It's a locally grown Timothy hay. It's very wonderful. Um, I believe it's kind of like a mix between second and third cut. It's still got some stems in it, but it's um, very nice and soft like a third cut. Um, so we have that for you. We also have some organic homemade bunny treats and that comes in a treat jar. And the treat jar says, um, life is better with a furry companion. And then it also comes with a little bunny plushie for your bunny or for you, whichever one. So anyways, I hope you guys like the rest of this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and, and enter the chance to win our giveaway. So to find out who won our special 100 subscriber giveaway, all you have to do is join us for a video next week where we'll be um, doing a drawing where we're going to announce the winner. Also, you can always visit our Facebook page. The link is down below. On our Facebook page will be further details. We'll announce the winner on there also, just in case you missed the, the video. And uh, we'll be giving you more information about that. So if you wanna check that out for more details, you can certainly do that. Thanks guys, and don't forget to share the bunny love. 